In today's video, I'm going to teach you how to change the time of a meeting that you've already scheduled in Microsoft Outlook. Whether there's a schedule conflict or a request to adjust a meeting start time, this guide will walk you through the steps, ensuring you can make changes with ease. Let's dive right in. First, we need to access Outlook. Open your web browser and navigate to the Outlook login page, which is part of Microsoft 365's suite of products. Once you're on the login page, you'll see the sign in button. Go ahead and click on this button to enter your login credentials. Type in your email and password to access your Microsoft Outlook account. Should you encounter any issues signing in, make sure your login details are entered correctly or consider resetting your password through the provided links. Once you're logged in, you'll find yourself in the mail section of Outlook. Outlook's interface can be busy, but don't worry, we'll guide you straight through it. Look to the bottom left corner of your screen where you'll see a few icon options like mail, calendar, people and tasks. Click on the calendar icon as we need to open your calendar to make the necessary changes to your meeting. The calendar view will provide you with a comprehensive look at all your scheduled events. From here, locate the specific meeting event you want to modify. If you're having trouble finding the event, you can make use of the search bar at the top of the page. Simply type in keywords related to the event name or participants involved to highlight the meeting quickly. In our example, let's assume it's simply labelled as sample event. Click on this event to open its details. After clicking on the meeting, you'll notice the event details window opens up. Here you can see a summary of all information related to the meeting, like date, time, location and attendees. What we're interested in right now is the edit option. Look for this option either at the top of the event window or sometimes as a pencil icon indicating you can make modifications. Go ahead and click on edit which will allow you to modify the meeting details including the time. Now let's change the meeting's time. You will see options to set both the start and end times of the meeting. Simply click on the time fields and select the new desired time from the drop down menu. Be sure to adjust both the start and end times accordingly to avoid leaving your meeting scheduled for unexpected lengths. As you do this, keep in mind that it's always courteous to inform attendees of any significant adjustments, especially if it's a large shift so they can accommodate the new schedule. You could consider leaving a short note in the description area explaining the change for transparency. Finally, it's crucial to save your changes to ensure the new meeting time is updated correctly. To do this, look for the save button, typically at the top left of the window. Click save or send update. By doing this, you not only save the new meeting time, but also automatically send a notification to all invited attendees, informing them of the updated details, which is convenient as it saves you the effort of notifying each participant individually. And there you have it, all done. You've successfully changed the time for a meeting in Outlook. Remember, these changes are reflected across any devices linked with your Outlook account, so you don't need to worry about making these changes elsewhere. We hope this guide was easy to follow and helps you manage your Outlook calendar more efficiently. Thank you for watching, and if you have any more questions or need further assistance with other Outlook features, feel free to leave a comment below or check out some of our other tutorials. Have a great day and good luck with your meetings.